guys, Chris Serena here from the Seltana Education Foundation's Virtual Classroom. Today, you can see we're here on the dock on a beautiful spring day in Chestertown with the schooner Sultana behind me. We're going to be talking a little bit today about how the sailors aboard the ship would steer the boat as they were crossing the ocean or navigating a waterway here like the Chester River. To steer Sultana, we have a device back here called a tiller. A tiller is essentially a large lever. This one's about six feet long, and on the back end of the tiller, it's attached to a long board that goes all the way down into the Chester River here called a rudder, and we'll show you that here in a minute. This tiller is also attached to a block and tackle system that gives whoever's pulling on this line a nice advantage of about four to one. So right now I have the power of four sailors because of this simple machine here. So to make the tiller go from side to side, you simply pull on this top line here, and you can see the tiller is moving accordingly. And this would essentially allow you to steer this boat. Okay, so we have Captain Aaron on the deck of the boat, on the quarter deck, and he is going to use a block and tackle system to move the tiller. So right now, Captain Aaron is pushing the tiller to his right or off to starboard, and you can see it's making the rudder down here at the water level, which is attached to the tiller, turn to the left. So by making the tiller go to the right and making the rudder be in this position, it would make the boat turn off to the left or off to port. So now Captain Aaron is gonna use that block and tackle system to pull the rudder, rudder all the way to port. You can see the rudder is moving along as the tiller gets moved. And this would make Sultana turn to the right. So it's kind of like opposite day. When that tiller is hard to port, the boat's gonna turn to starboard or to the right. When that tiller is hard to starboard, the boat is gonna turn to the left or off to port. So that tiller and the rudder work in tandem. So a lot of people that come on Sultana are surprised to see that we have a tiller and they ask us why we don't have a captain's wheel. The main reason is Sultana was a pretty small vessel for the 18th century. To have a larger captain's wheel, what you don't see on those boats is that a lot of the block and tackle system actually protrudes below decks. We simply didn't have the space on this little schooner to accommodate that. So a tiller was just a more simple uh, way to steer the vessel that required a lot less space. So to review, Sultana was steered with a tiller when the tiller is hard to port, it makes the boat turn to the right or to starboard. When the tiller is hard to the right or to starboard, it makes the boat turn left over to port. That's all for today's Sultana Education Foundation virtual classroom lesson. Hope you come back to see us for more cool videos.